Hi programmers, so I'm back. So basically in today's video, I would like to give you a feedback on my 49 inch ultrawide monitor from LG. Based on some feedback or reviews of this particular video on YouTube uh, from you guys, I found that I should need uh, to give some feedback uh, so that you can decide whether you have to go and buy this <laughs> machine or not. So basically, uh, this particular video is totally focused on the back end and I would like to show you that how I work in coding perspective only. So this is only for those guys who are programmers, software engineers or who want to become software engineers or who want to become a good productive software engineer or coder, something like that. So that being said, so let's start focusing on this one. So basically what I have over here is that multiple windows or tabs, which is something like this, okay? As you can see on the left hand side, I have browser, which is nothing but a client for launching my Swagger API clients or something like that so that I can test all the APIs there, okay? You can launch the postman there, okay? On the left hand side. In between, I have VS Code. Again, I put like little big space for VS Code, which I'm gonna tell you later on. Third window I have is my Docker. Fourth is the, again, the browser, which has the AWS console. Now, this is my pattern personally, and uh, I like this one because the thing is that uh, I want to put VS Code in front so that I can see the test whether API is working or not, whether something is going wrong on my logs of dockers directly over here. And while building some application, I can quickly see the logs saying that servers is uh, getting down or got some error on server side. I can't face the APIs or something is going wrong on the CloudWatch on AWS, something like that. So that is the big giant screen over here. The best thing now, the feedback, the first feedback, LG did a really good job is that they uh, worked on, you know, the micro pixel, I would say. The pixel, I love those pixels. Like I can see that like font are crispy, like literally really clean, really clean and everything. I can see all the fonts over here, um, like much more readable. I can't get that hardness out of my eyes you know, so that uh, I can feel uncomfortable or, or uh, I can feel like okay this is not working and something like that no it's like totally worth it I uh, when I sit I can work like hours and hours on this one because I can directly simultaneously get uh, the output or feedback saying that no this is not working this is working and then we are good to go so personally, I found like, okay, this, this particular machine is really good for me. That being said, there is the one screen. The other screen, which I have over here is down. Uh, I personally put this one in the Mac uh, or the other laptop screen, I would say, as my secondary screen. That secondary screen is nothing but for two purposes. One is for taking notes. And the second one is for entertainment purposes. So as you can see, I have some notes over here. I take some notes while building some applications. If I'm moving away or uh, something like that, I just make some plan and then move forward. And again, I have like some music which is going behind the scene, something like that. Okay, that being said, okay, let's go. And I'm gonna show you literally like how this big gigantic screen look like by recording the screen, okay? As you can see, this is my screen for the API gateway, sorry, the browser which I was talking on the left hand side. This is my VS code, which is like, again, neat and clean. And uh, this is the Django application, uh, sorry, uh, the Docker. And on the left hand side, the AWS console. So it's, it's quite good. And then you can take decision from here. I like only four tabs to be open. Yes, you can open multiple uh, six tabs, but you know, I, why <laughs> like you can't see like founts and everything and that doesn't make sense okay so for personal use i either put four or like minimum three that makes sense for me and really that increases my productivity significantly so uh guys do let me know what you want from my side if you have some question in regards to this one i can uh definitely give you on feedback Side, uh, what points you wanted to know about uh, 
um, like you wanted to see that the multiple screens and whatnot like so just do let me know i'll just create a short video for you like four five minutes something like that just like this and then you can take decision whether you have to go with this one or not last final point from my point of view is that this is an investment so yes you can invest if you want to become a productive uh, coder something like that uh, you will be having multiple options you can have multiple screens like two screens side by side but from my point of view uh, that is something different because that particular screen finishes in between right so over here in between I wanted to have my VS code but that VS code starts from here and I have to look for all the founds like this project directory that comes over here and then everything like that mess up mess up so the thing is that if that is in front of me I can you know go like go with the like uh, much more productive so that being said I love this monitor uh, if you want to invest definitely you can invest into it and then we are good to go all of this guys just do let me know in the comment sections if you have any questions thanks for watching bye for now